on YouTube. We, this is Robert from Robert Brates YouTube, and I am sitting here with a very special guest. Uh, this is actually my wife, uh, Carolyn. That's hey. It. And we are here today to we got a uh, special unboxing. Um, if you watched my video that I posted yesterday, you saw this awesome box that I said came from from a friend of ours. Our friend Bridget sent us a awesome uh, care package from Walt Disney World. Um, we know what's in the box, but we haven't seen what's in the box. Um, in person. In person. We didn't do it for the first time for you guys. And this is the box. This is what it looks like. All she nice and shipped. Way better packer than Barnes and Noble. Oh yes. <laughs> yes. Um, so thanks, Bridget. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna get going here. Um, I see a handy dandy Disney bag that we will probably wind up keeping and let you open that one. Okay. See a strap peeking out. That's a good sign. Straps peeking out are always good. Okay, sorry. I have to take it a little off camera. Alright. So, it is the Happy Halloween Cauldron from is this Snow White? Yes. Snow White, because you have the poison apple. And right it glows here. in the dark. It does glow in the dark. Actually, another thing it does, and I didn't know this till I opened it up, is it lights up as well. So, I don't know how it lights up. We will, we will figure out how it again, lights up. Because once again, I just found this. And then we got a little bag in here. So I'm gonna see what's in this little bag. Oh, there we go. And oh, that is cool. Oh my goodness. Disney. Disney is stepping up their game on popcorn buckets. Yes, they and are. And I will tell you that um, all, all except for one of our popcorn buckets is this right? All yeah. except for one. All except for one of our popcorn buckets is actually in my office <laughs> at work, and I have coordinating pops that go with the popcorn buckets as well. So this is going, because unfortunately I have Melissa Fent sitting in front of my <laughs> um, poison apple stein that I got two years ago? Well, yeah, two years ago. Two years ago when we went to um, Disney World for the Halloween party. So I'm going to turn this off because we had some goodies that were packed inside here. And I'll this, put this aside. This is the first one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is a Halloween party exclusive pen. Definitely one of my favorite characters is Orange Bird. Um, I don't know if you can see behind Carolyn, but you can definitely tell that we love our Orange Bird here in the Carlson household. We um, have a stuffed Orange Bird over on yes. the other side of the room. So this is Orange Bird. This is a limited release pen for the Not-So-Scary Halloween Party. And we have another one here, which is this awesome BB-8 pen. Um, definitely one of my favorite characters from the new trilogy of Star Wars movies. That is really neat. Let's see. Orange bird. Oh, Ooh, sorry. Oops. Dropped it. Party fell. I'm going to move these out of the way. I'm going to move this bag out of the way. So we've gone to Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party twice. Yes. We went last year and the year before. Um, last year we were Sully and Boo, yes. and the year before we were Vanellope and Wreck-It Ralph. And actually, we went to Atlanta Comic Con <clears throat> back in back in June, back in July. Back this in year. July, thanks to being a part of the Main Street Mouse. Shout out to Michelle and Scott Main, Main Street Mouse. Check them out on Facebook and yes, YouTube. Definitely. Oh my gosh, they are the coolest people. Um, but thanks to the Main Street Mouse and Robert doing some work for them we got press passes to go since we're local and they can't always make it up to these out-of-state events and we dressed up as Disney characters yes. <laughs> the whole time um, if you follow Robert on Instagram there, there are pictures there um, there are pictures there are more pictures of me because yes. <laughs> I'm the more uh, talkative one out oh, of the whatever. two of us then I'm going to open this up. I don't remember what this is. It's kind of heavy. I don't remember either. Oh! Uh, oh! This it's is my matching stein. 
Okay, so I have the first one that they came out with, and it's the red apple. We'll take all this off. It's the red apple stein, and they just came out this year with the green apple stein. So and this, this one glows in the dark, too. Definitely. I believe it glows in the dark. Oh, the red apple one does glow in the dark because I am always the last one to leave my work. And my office has no windows. So when I turn my office light off, I have to double check because I look up and there's something glowing oh. at the top of my, my cabinets in there. But this is definitely going to my work. So basically, so basically what you're saying is we're going to have to take the, the show on the road to Carolyn's office so she can yes. so, so she can show us around her office. Because yes, you're going to have to come see my wall of ma uh, mouse ears that I have up there and some Disney related stuff. And of course I do, I like minions, so I have a little minion things yep. here yep. and there. I got the some minions, minions up there. right there. I don't know if you can, yeah, you can see it. It's, it is right about there. And then this is the last thing. I, I know what this is. I, I, I had a uh, request. If you saw one of my previous videos, you know that we picked up the uh, Muppet Baby's Kermit. Um, oh, yes. And this. We are, we are children of the 80s. And this so guy right here. Muppet Babies were a big thing. <laughs> is one of my, another one of my favorite Muppets. I said Walter was my favorite Muppet. Animal is definitely top three. So definitely had to have Animal. Um, isn't he just cute? And like I said, I love my animal, and I love my Walter, so I've got this right here, which a uh, awesome custom artist friend of mine, um, Crazy for Vinyls, uh, check him out on Instagram, he made this for me, so I just wanted to show that off real quick while we're... On Hasn't the subject, he made us several? oh, he's made us. He's made us. He, several. He's made us way too many of them. I will definitely have to do a video just showcasing the ones he's he's yeah. made us. Um, I'm not. He, did he do our wedding ones? No, he didn't do the wedding ones. Um, he couldn't the, do the wedding no, ones, right? No, no, that was that was someone else. But, oh, my but, bad. I'm sorry. No, no, <laughs> she she's talking about our wedding customs that that we had done, and I'm just knocking stuff all over the place here, but I don't really care. So this turned from an unboxing to we're going to show you custom yes. stuff Yes, we're going to show us. These were made. This is mine. And they're based off our engagement pictures that Which, we had done. And this is Carolyn's. Um, actually, an, another artist friend of mine, uh, her name is Jillian Rice. Um, she made these for us. If you look on the back here, we'll move that a little bit closer that way. And we'll move that one that way ear hats with our names on them. Um, definitely had to have those for our wedding. Mm -hmm. So, you know, I mean, I, if you if you guys want to see more of my of my of our custom collection, I would gladly showcase them all for you because I have a lot of talented Disney friends who um, have definitely helped us out over the years with oh, yeah. with, uh, with with custom artwork, um, ma mainly Disney vinyl missions, but. Uh, you know, they've definitely helped us out in the past. So I'll definitely showcase off their artwork if you want to see it. If you want to see it, Tom, uh, leave a comment in, in the in the comments for us, and we'll definitely show it to you. I definitely have one video I'm definitely planning on doing. That is with the upcoming Wreck-It Ralph movie coming out. I definitely want to showcase our, yes. our collection of Wreck-It Ralph stuff that we have. We have some cool stuff there. Um, so definitely, definitely keep an eye out for that. Um, yeah. We were big Wreck-It Ralph oh, fans. Oh, yes. Yes, we are. And... People used to tease me before they even saw the movie, not the first movie that came out, that I was Vanellope. Yes, she is. And so <laughs> they were like, oh, you're totally that character, but they had never seen the movie. And so when I went and saw the movie, I came back and I was like, yes, I will gladly take Vanellope <laughs> as a character yeah, let me that see. I'm related to. Let me see if I can reach one of our records. I'll I'm gonna grab this one. Oh yeah, this, this is cool. a uh, holiday Wreck-It Ralph. It's a gingerbread style cookie that that again, crazy crazy for vinyls. Definitely, uh, he took care of this for me. He made this probably three years ago. Um, definitely good work. If you want, you know, again, um, 
you know, you know, just trying to showcase some of the some of our custom stuff. But again, if you want to see more of that, let us know. Uh, drop 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 a comment in the uh, in the comment section. We'll definitely definitely show that for you. Um, that's all we have for right now. Um, until the next time, we will see you guys later. Bye.